most consistent defensive efforts you guys have put forth in, in quite a while. What was the key to being able to sustain it for 48 minutes? You just stay locked in for 48 minutes on the defensive end. Um, didn't let anything get us down. You know, they didn't really make a make a big run. Anytime we had any any light breakdowns, we didn't we didn't get you know down on each other. We continued to stay together, and that's something we've been doing a lot even throughout practice and you know every day. So, guys are just locked in from from start to finish, just trusting each other, and, you know, trusting our principles. When Ennis gets going early like he did tonight, does that open up things for you all on the perimeter? Definitely, I get excited when he, when he gets going like that. I think he had 15 in the first quarter. And uh, he did a great job on the glass, and Steven did as well, and Mitch did as well. And those guys are uh, really learning to play off each other really well, even though we had a lot of different lineups. When did you start working on that kind of like quick trigger release that you've been using uh, lately? I've been, I mean, I've been doing it for a while. You know, from, since since high school, I've always had a pretty quick trigger, but it just always challenging myself to get it even quicker, and just having the confidence to continue to shoot it. You know, it's really it's really in, in workouts when you miss a few and you still have the confidence to shoot it. You know, and then in the game, it just translates easier. You know, you, you know, believe in yourself, and really the coaches running around and rebounding. You know, them not losing faith in me. So it's one of those things where I just continue to work on, it and it's just you know got quicker and quicker over time. How much of that progression has been this season with this staff? It's been huge. You know, uh, me and Vinny we do a lot of that every day. You know, we, we make a lot of shots. Sometimes we put a lot of emphasis on it. Sometimes I over exaggerate it when I'm working on it, and in the game, it doesn't seem as quick as it, as people think it is. But it's just this any other you know facet of the game that you work on and you want it to get better. You gotta over exaggerate, you know, and it's, it's that much easier in the game. How, how impressed were you with the way the bigs played tonight? It was huge, man. They've been playing well all season. You know, um, had some unfortunate injuries. Obviously, guys have been in and out, but you know they they still just been grinding, watching a lot of film. Uh, you know, they've been doing a great job. You know, I've been trying to track them. They do a good job on the offensive glass. I've just been trying to track them and get open threes and more opportunities for us. Can you tell they're still trying to get used to each other down there, working together? Yeah, yeah. I mean, definitely. It's, it's an adjustment still. We, we're not where we uh, want to be probably right now. But um, just the energy and effort makes up for that in itself right there. I know, I know offense is a big focus for you guys in training camp. You have more space and weak side movement, that type of stuff. You can talk a lot of trash on, uh, on Twitter, man. Me? Yeah, I've been looking at you. It's cool, play. What you say? I had to let him know. It's cool. <laughs> yeah, you funny. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I know. Turn it red. Must have been in front of everybody else. Uh, I know offense is a big focus for you guys. I mean, you guys have been on a ridiculous roll. Basically, since January 31st, this first game you've scored on the points. There's a lot of that stuff that you guys put in back in October. Is that showing up now? Yeah, but I mean, obviously, different lineups and, and things like that. It's really been on other to really push each other and really bring out the best of each other in practice and the games and everything like that. But uh, I think offensively we're doing so well. I think defensively we really, you know, took stepped it up a notch. And I think offensively we still shot pretty well from the floor. But you know, it's whatever it takes to win each and every game. You gotta make that adjustment. You guys are obviously shorthanded, but are finding different ways to win. Do you guys feel, or maybe you personally, that you're playing with a, an extra kind of chip on your shoulder with something improved, maybe? Um, I mean, I wouldn't say. I, I think we were like that anyway. I think that's that's just how we are as a team. You know, we got guys that got that chip on their shoulder. That all stars feature all the famous. So I think that mentality just trickles down. Anybody else? Thanks, Amos.